you really like this girl but you fear that she might be leading you on so how do you know when to back off and to stop pursuing a Filipina girl? Hello there beautiful people, so Filipinas here and welcome back to my channel guys. So for today's video, we are going to be talking about when and why you should stop pursuing a Filipina girl. Okay, so without further ado, let's get started. Well, you know what guys, the problem with dating these days is that there are so many rituals that people have to go through before they can establish that they are officially in a relationship. And you may think that you and the Filipina girl that you're talking to are technically an item, but unfortunately, she might not be on the same page with you. And just because you made an effort to pursue a girl does not even mean that you have got your relationship in the bag already with her. Because unfortunately, sometimes a girl can't even make up her mind or it's just too nice to tell you point blank that she has no intention of going out with you anymore. So when and why you should stop pursuing a Filipina girl? Okay, so first one guys is that you should stop pursuing a girl if you know to yourself that you are not her type. Okay, well I am very sorry but that is just the truth. Just because you're rich, you have a nice body, amazing body, you're very nice, kind to her, and you're very handsome, doesn't mean that she's gonna fall for that. You know, because every one of us has a typical preferences for the person that we really wanna be with, right? And you know what, guys? Some Filipinas would actually prefer a specific race, body type, height, or even a certain level of intellect or social status. And if she's really hard to please and you don't pass her standards, well, pursuing her is just really nonsense. And the second one is you are just a rebound. Well, not everyone is really comfortable with, you know, starting a relationship if they are still attached to their past boyfriend or to their ex-boyfriend or, you know, husband. And the reason why they're not willing to go through with dating you could be because they're still not over their ex. But it would still depend on you though if you still really want to pursue her or just find someone else that doesn't have baggages in life. So the next one is that if she replies to your texts or your DMs with closed answers, all right? And do not mistake this for the popular passive-aggressive letter K, which actually means keep talking to me because I need to feel that you are giving me a lot of attention because, you know, if they're really not interested with you, then they will definitely do a lot of things or everything that they can to stop the conversation on track. You know, like if she's not interested with you guys, but she's just going to reply to you with a letter K or, you know, just a simple OK or like letter O and letter K. And, you know, those short replies is an indication for you to stop pursuing her because that is actually an indication where it says to you and telling you like low-key telling you that she's not interested to reply to you and talk to you and by the way guys if you really want to be with a filipina girl that is very good and very genuine and you really want or if you have any plans to settle down or retire here in the Philippines and you need someone to assist your visa, then you can go ahead and click the link on my bio or click the link on my description box below. And also, you should stop pursuing a Filipina girl if she only says yes to dates that have the best freebies, okay? And you know what? I actually know a lot of girls that are actually doing this, like they would only go with you or like go on with you on a date if they know that you are setting up a very fancy date where they can get a lot of nice expensive foods and also they know at the back of their mind that you're gonna spend a lot of money to impress her on that date which is probably you're gonna spend or give her a nice fancy bag or clothes or whatever is that so if you know this to yourself that she would only say yes to go out with you every time that you're gonna set up a nice fancy dates or expensive dates. 
but if you don't offer or like ask her on a very fancy date then she would just say no to you then just an indication that she is probably a gold digger or you know she's just trying to hang out with you because of the freebies or the free loads that she can get when she's with you okay, so the next one is that you should stop pursuing a girl's guys if she scene zones you or like she doesn't even read your messages for a day or more than a day you know well unless if the girl that you're seeing is really against technology there is no reason for her of why she wouldn't be able to receive your message you know but i guessed she really saw your text but she just doesn't really want to reply or start a conversation with you because probably you are not the guy that she really want to talk to the next one guys is if she keeps you interested up to a point okay so you cannot really stop thinking about her because she designed your situation to end up that way you know like basically giving you a scraps of affection or time attention but she still manages to keep you hanging because she's probably keeping you as a backup plan until she finally finds her one true love you know like she's just hanging you around she's messaging you she gives she's giving you this time and affection but you can feel that there's something's off you know like you can feel that it's just a breadcrumbs of attention and probably she's doing that is because she just really wants you to be there until she finally find someone that she can you know that she's really interested to the next one guys is that if she never initiates anything with you all right so maybe you don't really notice it at first because you are just really blinded by love or lust but after a while you start to realize that she never initiates a text or a calls or you know asking you on a date to see you and sometimes you feel like if you did not reach out first then you may never like hear anything from her again the next one is if she blows hot and cold all right so this might actually confuse you because sometimes she seems really into you and then other times she's just very cold and very uninterested and you know she might just like the attention from you when she is blowing hot and if she's blowing cold then maybe she is just getting attention from other guys and she is just really annoyed by you at the moment so and the last but not the least is that you should stop pursuing a filipino girl if after you supporting her like giving her money or any form of support you know after talking to her after giving her something like that then you know you will never get to hear from her in a few weeks or in a few months or maybe like for such a long time and then after a few months after a few weeks she's back again to give you you know to love bombing you to give you a lot of time and attention because she probably is going to get something from you again so basically what i'm trying to say is you should stop pursuing a girl if you know that she would ghost you or she would stop talking from you after giving her something that would benefit her okay because that is actually not a love and it's not even worth it you know you should be talking to someone that after supporting her she is still there talking to you and giving you genuine love and affection well of course guys you put in a lot of effort in trying to get the girl that you like to like you back but you have to know when to give up as well or when to stop as well because some girls are really worried to wait but a lot of them don't really want to wait with the guys that they are not interested so foreigners out there who are watching this video guys do not be rush in love okay and also just a friendly reminder everyone that do not ever sell yourself short because there is at least one filipina woman out there who will really appreciate the attention that you give them and will reciprocate that and you should never ever settle for someone who doesn't want the same things with you 
that you really want to do because that is just a big waste of your time and it's not even worth it so yes that's it everybody thank you so much for watching my video and if you guys are really interested in dating someone from the philippines then you can go ahead and click the link on my bio or click the link on my description box below see you to my next video bye